Anton Levy was the founder of the Church of Satan. He died on October 30, 1997, and unfortunately, because God's church is the sleeping giant, Levy's followers and his agenda, to desensitize Christians through the media, lives on. Here are some astonishing quotes of his, the TV set is the satanic family altar. Television is the major mainstream infiltration for the new satanic religion. It should be brought out that we not only condone, but encourage all types, of what would be called sexual perversity and deviations, because we feel that in a few short years it will be established that everyone is a sexual deviant and pervert. In the Satanic Bible, Levy explained that he was moved to establish the Church of Satan, when he saw the need for a church, that would recapture man's body and carnal desires as objects of celebration. The Church of Satan preaches a religious system that endeavors, to overcome the repressions and inhibitions of human instinctual behavior it believes has been fostered by the Judeo-Christian tradition. The Church of Satan directly attacks all the Christian principles, which this country was founded upon. Through television, internet, and various forms of media, the Church of Satan is winning the war, but only if we let it. Daniel J. D. Noon Web MD from the article Media Exposure Linked to Child, Teen Health, Behavior Problems says, when the researchers looked at kids, who said their parents strongly disapproved of them having sex, those who watched more than two hours of television a day were 70% more likely to have sex. And if sex disapproving parents didn't monitor their teen's TV viewing, more than two hours a day of TV upped a teen's odds of sexual initiation by 250%. The study by the Parents' Television Council, titled Happily Never After finds that television broadcast networks depict sex within marriage, as either non-existent or burdensome, while showing positive depictions of extramarital or adulterous sexual relationships with alarming frequency. These study results suggest that many in Hollywood are actively seeking to undermine marriage by consistently showing it in a negative manner, said Tim Winter, president of the PTC, in a release. He goes on to say that in addition to its mostly negative portrayal of marriage, television has also become a stage for sexual expression that would have been unacceptable less than a generation ago. Those include, according to the survey, threesomes, partner swapping, pedophilia, necrophilia, bestiality and sex with prostitutes. Add to that depictions of strippers, references to masturbation and sex toys, and television has created the perfect storm to blast away the last remnants of family values in Hollywood, the report suggests. Winter said the phenomenon will undoubtedly influence the values of future generations. You can read the full article at, Satan is very clear about his agenda. But Christians are swimming in a pot of poisonous complacency, that is slowly but surely taking over the hearts and minds of God's army, rendering them powderless. There is not a chance of winning this war, when the army of God keeps giving Satan a foothold into their hearts and minds. It is time for a holy revolution.